Good afternoon. Thanks so much for watching us. I'm Stella Escobedo. And I'm Eric Connors. The woman shot in the head with a beanbag round at a protest in La Mesa is speaking out for the first time. Leslie Furcron was just recently released from the hospital. A video of her at the May 30th protest outside La Mesa's police headquarters. It circulated on social media and led to accusations of police brutality. News 8's Chris Groh has the message Furcron and her attorney want to get out. And one of the first things that Furkron said to us was that essentially she is so thankful for the staff at the hospital and her family for being there for her and helping her on her road to recovery and getting to the place where she is now. Now that road is still a long way away from a complete recovery, but she also lamented that essentially she never wanted this to be a part of her life. I'm a productive member of society. I go to San Diego City College. I was, that's changed working on a bachelor's degree as a social service worker. I'm also a woman in recovery, productive member of society. I'm a law-abiding citizen. Now we want to warn you, the video and photos you're about to see are graphic. Again, that video shows 59-year-old Leslie Furcron, that grandmother, getting hit in the face by that beanbag round during a protest here in La Mesa on Saturday, May 30th. She was taken to the hospital where she was in a coma until the following Monday, according to her family. Now, Furcron wasn't released until yesterday, and as you saw there, still very weak. Her face bandaged again from that beanbag round that hit her in the face, and she was really barely able to to speak to us only spoke for a couple of minutes before having to leave now her attorney says they do plan on holding the la mesa police department liable and that the only thing Furcron is guilty of is littering that she did not throw anything at officers i asked her attorney whether or not they believe that this officer fired directly and on purpose at Furcron, and this was his response absolutely I, I, and i believe the la mesa police department has admitted uh, by their self-serving timeline They've admitted that that officer fired in retaliation for what he thought was Ms. Furcron throwing an object. Now, also today, her family's attorney did confirm that it was indeed a beanbag round that hit Furcron. Obviously, there was a little bit of uh, unknown as to whether it was a different type of projectile, but it was indeed a beanbag round. Again, the family does say that they do plan on seeking legal action against the La Mesa Police Department.